I'm getting another nose surgery to make it look like a so. No. The reason I'm getting another surgery is because one of my nostrils is like obstructed and they're gonna remove something like really quickly. It should be really easy and quick. Hopefully, but yeah, we kind of knew we were gonna have to do this like a couple of months ago But we decided to wait until the swelling goes down to see if it like gets better But now it's been four months after my surgery and I'm breathing fine But this one there's a little tissue inside the nose that's like obstructing it a little and I would breathe better if it's removed And yeah, I'm gonna go through another surgery. I also don't know how it's gonna like do they put me under general anesthesia again or do they just give me a squeeze ball and say endure? Uh, I don't know, but I was told to not eat today anything. A mukbang account that's not eating. <gasps> I don't know, last time I had surgery, I had like a whole list of don't paint your nails, remove acrylics, don't wear makeup, don't wear contacts. This time they just said don't eat, so... I don't know if I was supposed to do everything I did the first time. <laughs> if you don't give me detailed instructions, I'm not gonna do it. Because I'm not that smart, I'm sorry. Don't make fun of me, but I'm taking Kai with me as emotional support. So this is me when I got to the hospital. I had to wait for a couple of minutes. Also, I look kind of homeless from the subway, don't judge me. Then they gave me my room. Hi. And they gave me their clinic attire to change into. So I guess I am going into anesthesia. This is me in the hospital attire. How do I look? rate my feet, do I look slay? I think I still look slay and this is me right after the surgery I look pretty rough but still slay am I right? do we slay? yes we do so they brought me water because my throat was the Sahara Desert it was very bad because I wasn't allowed to drink from this morning because I was fasting and yeah then I just changed into my clothes and went home I took the subway by the way because I felt pretty normal and I had a mask, so no one suspected a thing. And yeah, you guessed it. The first thing I did was go to the McDonald's. So I was hungry because I had to fast it since yesterday. So I was like, I don't know why, but my brain just went go to McDonald's. And then I had to make the hardest decision of my life, which is choosing a burger. It's always really hard to do when you're in McDonald's in Korea. I don't know why. So yeah, I chose the random one. And then I waited for my food and I did take out because I'm not gonna eat in McDonald's looking like that. Yeah, I got my food and I went home. Hello. Okay, they told me I have to remove this tonight myself. I don't have to keep them. But for now we keep them. They gave me medicine. Stuff. We're gonna box this soon. Also, look at this. I found a tiny microphone. I bought it just because I want to interview my cats when I go back to Ukraine. Also, I got an adapter because it's not for iPhone. Okay, I will get with emotional support. Let's see what they got me here. Okay, so they got me a bunch of Q tips. I don't know why they gave me this long glass. The last time they also gave me this one. A bunch of pills. A bunch of them. They're really easy to understand because each has a number of which day you have to take it and also a picture of sunrise, just sun, and moon. So you know when to take them based on pictures. As for dumb people like me that don't know Korean eggs, a cream, it's like an antibacterial cream you apply and then H2O2. Now I'm hungry. I haven't had any food since yesterday night because I have to fast for the surgery. So I got McDonald's because it's... I don't know why my mind always goes to McDonald's when I'm in pain. I'm not in pain, but I can't feel anything, but it's uncomfortable to have this on. I got a Fanta today because this time I tried a Mirinda. But I'm gonna go wash my hands because they're dirty from the subway. Last time I got a Mirinda and it made me realize that I miss having fun Fanta because Fanta is pretty popular in Ukraine. My grandpa always... My grandpa died. My grandma always buy it. buys it. I guess she likes Fanta. The fries are all over the place. I think I need a plate for this. <laughs> Last time I filmed at McDonald's, people were commented that it's a surprising packaging in Korea. They have like this. 
I dropped it. They have like this paper thing around the burger to keep it intact. Innovation. I need water. If you've had surgery before, they put like thing inside your throat, I think, for the anesthesia. And it makes your throat really dry. As dry as my jokes on TikTok. And I haven't had any drink from the hospital to hear my throat. It's begging for a drop of water. But I'm not gonna give it to my throat. Man, so I'm gonna give it Fanta, not water. By the way, how do you say it? Fanta or Fanta? Because in Ukraine it's Fanta. Great, I needed that water imitation. This table is not big enough for me to be able to show it. I'm gonna try. Gosh. My laptop goes on the floor. It's not like it's my only source of income, my laptop. I still respect it, but we have mutual understanding of sometimes one of us goes on the floor. I'm gonna bring the ketchup. Oh, by the way, I bought this cola yesterday. It has a teddy bear in it. It's a knockoff cola with a teddy bear. What can be better? I brought a tiny bowl plate for the ketchup. I'm running out of ketchup. I am I eat ketchup like it's water. Did they only give me one ketchup again? I didn't even check because I, I know they always betray me. Okay, food. By the way, if anyone is wondering, I don't pay anything for like additional surgeries when I go. Or for any other procedure like laser treatments that I got. Because my surgeon does like everything in one package. You pay one time and then he makes sure your nose is fine. Even if he has to do like the additional surgeries. So I'm glad that's a thing. Because surgeries are expensive and I don't want to deal with that again. Let's see the burger. I just got a random one. I don't know what I, what I got. I always like panic at McDonald's when it's sharp time to order. I choose because know what burger to choose i'm not a burger expertise expert i see bacon i see a patty bacon and vegetables my lips are numb my lips is only numb at this part because i got surgery in this nostril this is fine this one i can't feel it Sometimes when I don't chew enough, I try to swallow the food and it gets stuck and I start doing... How do you call those? I don't know what you call those, but I do that. I'm just quirky like that. My body is just annoying. Oh, by the way, I'll tell you how much the McDonald's was because sometimes people ask. It was 7500, so it's like that. I don't do that in real time. It's not how my brain works. I'm gonna finish my... Burger. And yeah, this was my second surgery and hopefully the last. Also, he said there's not any like visible recovery signs, like I'm not gonna have bruises or swellings or anything like that. So, it should be chill. Then I had a video call with my cat, with one of them. This is Taki, as you can see, he was so interested in seeing me, he was so happy. He was just thrilled to be there, wow, so amazed. He literally looked only when I did this with my finger, he was... You know what? Screw you, Taki. So fake. Screw you, Taki.